Which one of these two decks are you drawn to the most? And whichever one you're drawn to, this reading is for you. If you are drawn to this deck, this is your reading. If you are drawn to the other one, the reading will be posted after this one. So go to my page. Okay, so we have the Prosperity Begins card in reverse. So you may be feeling like some kind of project has come to a standstill or a relationship, something that you feel like you were fighting really hard for or you were putting in a lot of effort. It feels like, yeah, you're not reaping the rewards at this time. So what else do you need to know about this? Fertility in reverse, yeah. Like you're really starting to feel like there's no growth in something. So yeah, this could be a about a relationship or something creative or about your work or even a home project. It's like you have the ideas, you have the dream, but you don't seem to be getting the results right now. We've got rest and rejuvenate. So it does feel like you're needing to be in a more restful and receptive place at this time. There is a greater divine reason for this standstill. I just get the sense that you're losing hope right now. So what else do you need to know about this? Deception and envy in reverse. Yeah, there's something you're not seeing very clearly. This card in reverse can be about self-deception. So it does feel like there's a fog over your eyes right now, but it's there again for a greater purpose. <laughs> oh my God. The third eye chakra card just flew out over here. So we're just saying about there being a block in front of your eyes. I mean, we've literally caught the third eye. So it may be that your third eye, your intuition is blocked at this moment. So you're needing to come to a place of rest and rejuvenation in order to clear the pathway. Now you may even be suffering with headaches or literally blurry vision. So this can be an indication of needing to clear the third eye. Oh wow, and then we've got the solar plexus chakra. It almost feels like by you stepping out of your comfort zone and being more confident, using the color yellow more in your life. I feel like there's a lack of confidence in wanting to move forwards, okay? Or there's some kind of pride or ego issue that's holding you back. But I see you being in such a strong, authentic place where you know who you are and you may not know the direction that you're going in, but you know the destination you want to end up in. So it's just about following those steps. And I feel like the more that you can follow your intuition rather than your mind, the more it will start to make sense and the easier it will all start to flow for you.